ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, we're going to be exploring and talking about what the flying crap is on Mars right now. Because according to the ESA, um, European something something, uh, there's spiders on Mars, and I'm going to show you guys some pictures here. There's they they found quote unquote spiders on Mars. Um. So we're going to be taking a little deep dive um, into more on what these possible spiders could be. And um, yeah, if you guys want to stay tuned, uh, continue watching the video, I guess. All right, here we go. So spacecraft spot spiders scattered scattered across the surface of Mars. Dude, no way. A unique phenomenon that could be mistaken for spiders scurrying. I don't know scuttling, but I'm just gonna say scurrying across the planet's surface has been spotted on Mars, according to the European Space Agency. The ESA said the news release that one of its Mars Express orbiter captured images of the spiders which are just really small, dark-colored features that begin to be formed when sunshine falls on carbon dioxide deposited during the planet's winter months. The light causes the carbon dioxide ice at the bottom of the deposits to turn into gas, which eventually bursts into ice that can be up to three feet thick, shooting dust out the geyser-like blast before setting on the surface, the space agency said. That was just a lot of science. While the spots might look tiny from space, they're actually fairly large. ESA said that the patches are as small as 145 feet wide. Fairly large. He just down the person just downplayed how big this is. The patches are 145 feet. L let's look at this picture again. So, if I'm understanding this correctly, this little black thing right here is 145 feet big or wide <laughs> what a downplay <laughs> that is humongous um at their largest might cover over half a mile wide below those large spots the arachnid light pattern is carved beneath the carbon dioxide ice the esa said the spider patterns were observed by the exomars trace gas orbiter which launched in 2016 and has been studying mars for signs of possible life a possible past life. The majority of the dark spots captured by the orbiter appear on the outskirts of a of a part of Mars nicknamed Inca City because of its linear, most geometric network of ridges. Reminiscent of Incan ruins, the area discovered in 1972 by a NASA probe is also known as Angantus Labrada and is near the planet's south polar cap. So, I guess, yeah, we're looking at Inca City right now. Um, crazy. So, I guess this is the area it happens in. It's not clear how the area was formed, the ESA say. said. Suggestions include sand dunes that turn into stone over time, or material like magma, or sand seeping through the rock. Arthur Rock. Mars is currently experiencing spring-like weather, according to NASA. NASA's Curiosity rover has been enjoying the warmer weather on the planet. The agency said in a news release, working on environmental monitoring and exploring Mars Gale Crater. So, yeah, that's crazy. So, that's the end of the video. If you guys want me to do more videos like this, let me know in the comments down below. And yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.